Hey loves, it is Cree aka Intellect and Heels and I am back with another video and can you guys believe that the summer is almost over and we're going into fall and yep this is what this video is going to be all about. It's going to be about the fall trends that I've been recognizing and I want to talk to you all about. To all of my oldest but goodies, thanks for joining me. Thanks for coming back to see me and for all of my newbies if you love faith, fashion, beauty, and lifestyle then you are going to enjoy this channel so go ahead and hit that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so you never miss when i upload a video i usually upload on fridays at 8 a.m eastern time so you do not want to miss out okay now on to these fall trends because we got to be looking good for this fall y'all be right back okay loves let's get into these trends that i'm seeing coming up for the fall number one is the oversized look it's not going anywhere okay um especially making its comeback for fall because you know in the summertime it's kind of hard to do oversized especially because it's hot and you don't want to have a lot of go going on but for the fall you can do this oversized look and layer it up and it's going to be great and oversized sweater oversized trousers or the wide leg trousers i'm seeing they're not going anywhere. The oversized jacket, of course, took a step back for the spring summer because it's hot, but then it's coming back for the fall. And what I love about what I'm seeing, and it's the more chic put together looks. They're not just oversized and sloppy and everywhere, but they're chic and put together and they're a lot more feminine. They have a little feminine edge to them. Of course, you have the structure, but you got a little femininity in there and I'm loving that for the fall and of course you got the fall tones the i think this like forest green is going to be one of those good colors for the fall but of course you got your nudes and your beiges and your browns that are going to be doing their thing this fall as well so putting all of that together is going to be a good look for you okay okay trend number two that i am seeing is the vest the vest girl sweaters I've been seeing this advertised all on my feed. They're feeding me the vest, okay? And I think I'm gonna eat. I think I'm gonna take a little bite out of this trend with the vest, especially here in Florida, since it's a warm weather. I can wear the vest without anything under it. You can wear a button up vest, you can wear a sweater vest with some wide leg trousers and you will be giving it to the girls. And I am just loving what I'm seeing. Very utilitarian, very put together, very suit-like. So if you're going into the office, this is an awesome look for you. You can put a shirt under it. You can dress it up. You can dress it down. I love it. And you know we'll be giving it to the girls. I'm going to try to figure out how I can put this, this whole outfit together. But some wide leg jeans with a denim vest with a denim like coat like one of the like not like a jacket like the regular jean jacket that we see but like a denim like more structured jacket over it. A whole denim look with the vests and the wide leg girl we will be putting all the trends together into one look and um it it's going to give it's going to give i'm going to try to find this look and put this look together because i just thought of it and i'm like that would be the perfect fall look it will be giving you everything at once because y'all know denim not going nowhere you know the girls are still gonna have the denim on you know we're gonna still be doing the denim thing so if you got some denim, don't worry. It's not going anywhere. You can still wear your denim. Okay, the other things that I've been eyeing are hats. We're doing the hats, y'all. And y'all know I'm a hat collector. Y'all know I've been collecting my caps. And I'm seeing more caps coming our way. And I'm like, I'm feeling you. So if you got a baseball cat, you got a trucker cat, you got wear your hat and it's more especially it's not so much like the fedora hats like it was before it's more so like caps like baseball caps trucker caps they're doing their thing like I'm seeing it I'm seeing those on my feet as well and I'm loving it because I am a cap girl and I've been getting into this whole cap thing and we're going back into like those type of hats and I'm liking it because it's really sporty and you can really chic it up with this oversized look. I mean, putting all those things together is a look in itself. I'm excited about it. I'm excited about these caps. So we got the caps going on 
as well. Um, we still got the cargo pants doing their thing. They're not going away. You're probably just going to have to not even wear them in a different color. If you got some jean cargo pants or you got some beige cargo, cargo pants, which is the normal color for them, they're still going to be doing their thing because cargo pants are in in and of themselves very like baggy and loose fitting so if you got the cargo pant you're gonna be doing your thing anyway girl so just go ahead and take them out get them ready press them iron them so you can wear your cargo pants for the fall as well and then we have sheer like i have on now my tool shirt from zara but yes we have the sheer is still a thing sheer is still a thing but it's more like peekaboo sheer so you can have sheer in the skirt with something covered on top or sheer on the top more covered on the bottom so it's not more of a like a completely sheer look but it is like more i don't want to say like tasteful but more like peekaboo here's a sheer here but i'm going to cover this part so yeah i'm loving that for the fall of course you can have a cute sheer skirt with the oversized jacket on be giving it to the girls so yes and i there also i've seen a lot of like the little tool dresses that are coming back where you can wear the tool dress with a shirt like a turtleneck under it with some jeans with some tennis because y'all know those adidas are in style again those flat adidas i can't think of the name of them right now the samoas yeah they're back in style and with that with some jeans with the tool dress over it with the turtleneck girl i just gave you a look for free there you go you can have it that is how you combine denim and sheer so i'm just combining all of these trends for y'all showing y'all how to rock them for the fall but yes that would be great as well and i'm seeing that as well a lot of the tool dresses that are in style are coming back in style right now they kind of quieted down for a while but i'm starting to see them pop back up so that's super cool as well and if all else fails just get you some leather girl leather skirt leather pants leather shorts just buy you some leather some leather it could be pleather we don't mind pleather we don't mind faux leather just get you something that looks like leather it's fall time this is the perfect time to wear your leather to bring out the things so wear that as well i'm not going to really do shoes in this video because i think i'm going to do a separate video as far as what's trending as far as like boots and stuff for the season i haven't seen a whole lot of that coming through the shoes coming through just yet so i might have to do that a little later in this in maybe like next month i'll do fall trends as it pertains to shoes because i haven't seen it change a whole lot um so there hasn't been a huge shift in the shoes that we're wearing but the only shift i have seen one slight shift and i'm going to share that then but as far as clothing that is what i'm seeing and i wanted to give y'all my creed trend report for fall 2023 so y'all can be ready so y'all can dig into your closets and see what you got and also maybe have to dig in your wallets and see what you got as well because we're going to be rocking it out this fall. Okay. Okay. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, this is just what just a snort, short snapshot of what I've been seeing so far. We're still in summertime, so it's still pretty early. But uh, like I said before, I wanted to get you all prepared for what is coming so you can be ready. Okay. Okay. So I hope you're having a good day, evening, afternoon, whenever you are watching this, and I will see you next time. Light, love, and blessings. Peace out. Yeah.